<laughs> I only read the uh, the first the first paragraph. That's all I read. I ain't reading no more than that. It's probably a long uh, article here, but uh, let's get on to it. So it says Red Dead Redemption 2 update leaves fans seriously unhappy. This is by Dan Lipscomb. 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 It's an interesting last name. Could be an alias, but I digress. Anyways, uh, let's see. Red Dead Redemption 2. Um... These fans are unhappy. This is so. I, this is all I read was this one. I ain't read past this part here. This, this, it says Red Dead Redemption Two fans are unha- are angry. A recent rumor has been doing the rounds, stating that the standout Western from Rockstar Games is coming to Nintendo Switch, and this has started off a lengthy back and forth on Reddit of all places. As to why it is bad news, it is even if it's even real news at all, huh? I personally don't care that it's going to Nintendo Switch. I don't give a shit. <laughs> I mean, how is that? How is that? Why? I don't get. Why would you be angry about that? Maybe I maybe I understand if I as I keep reading on. Let's see. It goes on to say there are several angry threads to follow here. Firstly, would the Red Dead Redemption Two even work on Nintendo Switch, given the size of the game, the graphical fidelity, and the depth of the AI? Secondly, if the news is true, then why would Rockstar Games choose their Western adventure over? Grand Theft Auto 5. What? So people are concerned as how it's going to run on Switch. Now, if you don't own the Switch, it's laughable. And if you do own a Switch and you don't own a PS4 or, or, or Xbox One, yeah, I can see you being a little bit upset because you're a little bit worried about how the game's going to run on the Switch. However, if you own the Switch and a PS4 or Xbox One, then you have nothing to be uh, be angry about. It, it's, it's fucking ridiculous. So <laughs> this this is this is really this is really funny to me. That's people, why people are upset anyway. Why Why is anger the emotion that you feel over this? I don't get it. Because they choose what this says. It said, wait, if the news is true, then why would Rockstar Games choose their Western adventure over Grand Theft Auto V? What you mean choosing their Western adventure over Grand Theft Auto V? Which, I don't understand that. But they want the Grand Theft Auto V. What you want, GTA V to go over the Switch? I mean, the only thing I can see from this is is that worry, not anger, just worry, like, if it's going to run it good on the Switch. Because we know the Switch is not as powerful as the uh, PS4, for example. So, yeah. This is kind of funny article. Okay, it says, one Redditor comment, commented, me after seeing the Rockstar logo. Accompanied by the iconic scene in the Terminator of Sarah Connor being blasted by a nuclear fireball. Me Terminator 2? <laughs> this comment is accompanied by many more echoing similar thoughts. Oh, that's like a, uh, a picture of Sarah Connor oh, in Terminator 2 when she, when she gets okay. When she has that dream or that vision, whatever, if you want to call it that, uh, of a nuclear war. Nuclear bomb being dropped, everybody being killed by it. Wow, that's how they feel? Okay. <laughs> and this goes on to say, uh, the Switch, which is now getting on in years, is suffering under the weight of open world games. Even the most recent Pokemon release saw a struggle in performance. 
so could the hardware even run Red Dead Redemption too well. Well, our Red Dead Redemption 1 is on the Switch. How was that running? From what I heard, it's running pretty well. I'm assuming that Red Dead Redemption 2 is bigger than, than uh, 1. Because, you know, once they come out with a sequel, they got to make it bigger, don't they? So, I don't see... I mean, it's a, it's, it'd be like a little worry, but not like a big worry I will have on it. What is this? Oh my God. Move. Get off, the, get off the page. Get off the picture. Why is this playing? I'm not trying to show. What is this? I can't even get off. The, I can't even exit out of this. Trying to exit out of this, but it won't let me do it. Oh my god! Did I have to let the ad play? I, I can't find it. Where? Hold on. Hold on for a second. Uh, I'm sorry. I had to turn it to portrait mode to get rid of it. I had to, because I couldn't see the X to exit out the ad. Sorry about that. Oh my God. I'm going to get in trouble. I'm going to get penalized for that because I didn't mean it. I mean, it just blasted in my face, like blasted all on the fucking screen. Okay, I'm trying to figure out where am I at. But this is a whole other article. I'm not even on this one. Maybe I clicked on it because accidentally I didn't mean to. Okay, here it is. Here we are. Um, let's see. Yeah, because the Pokemon, the recent Pokemon release is struggling in performance. Yes, yeah, so let's let's on uh, whatever, lady. Okay, so. Okay, some fans speculate that this rumor, which came from a ratings board in Brazil, could point to the game being a launch title for Nintendo Switch, too. Oh, like, yeah, they could be waiting for Nintendo Switch, too, the next one, which is rumored to have the graphical capacity of the last generation of consoles. Ah. Yeah, we expect that the Nintendo Switch 2 to be better than the 1, right? Which would be a lame-ass fucking name to call it. But moving on, um, then there, there are those who are wondering why Rockstar would consider a launch of Red Dead Redemption 2 over GTA 5, which is thought to be, among many, the defining franchise for Rockstar, not table tennis, sadly, whatever the fuck that is. Another Redditor chimes in wondering, instead of porting Red Dead Redemption 1 to the to the Red Dead Redemption 2 engine, they are going to port Red Dead Redemption 2 to the Red Dead Redemption 1 engine and release it for the Switch? Personally, I'd rather see a new gen Red Dead Redemption 2. I don't think they're going to do that. They're not going to um, port Red Dead Redemption 2 using the Red Dead Redemption 1 engine and release it. I don't think they're going to do that. They're going to try to release the game itself for the Switch. I don't think they're going to downgrade the graphics like that or the visuals like that. I mean, no, they ain't going to do it like that. Okay, it says, then there are comments that states the situation simply by saying 240p slash 10 FPS it will be interesting to see how the situation unfolds. Yeah. yeah. Just got to wait and see on that shit. So, yeah, um, that's the end of that article. <laughs> uh, yeah. 
So what do I think about this? <laughs> like I said, it's nothing to be upset about. I don't get why why the why it's written like that. Why would you be upset about this? It's crazy. It's you know what they they said they want they rather have Grand Theft Auto Five go to sleep. Grand Theft Auto Five is a big game too. I don't understand why would they want five, Grand Theft Auto Five to go to Switch's boat opposed to Red Dead Redemption Two. Shit, why not both of them? Fuck it. <laughs> why not? Um. I mean, yeah. I mean, shit. <laughs> That's pretty much it for this, man. For with 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 this here. Uh, yeah. Um. Uh, those are my thoughts, man. It's gonna be upset about. A little worry how it will run, especially if you only own the Switch and you don't have a. Another, the other consoles that the game is running on, like Xbox One or PS4. But yeah, other than that, there's nothing to be mad about. You know, I'm interested to see how it's going to run on the Switch. I'm interested to see what I hear about it, how it's running on the Switch. They should wait for the next one to, re- to re-release uh, Red Dead Redemption 2, in my opinion, because it would be more powerful than the original Switch anyway. They should just wait. I mean, shit. I mean, why release it on the Switch, the, uh, on, on the current Switch, when they can wait to the next one and then we release it? Red Dead Redemption 2. So, anyways, with that being said, this is why Crumbles don't sign the fuck out. Uh, peace and love. Good health to you all. And be safe out there. Peace. I'm out of here.